That's gone. Got this one going. Okay. All right. So stand up for me. All right. So you want to be hammer size? Yeah. Okay. So take a deep breath in for me. And uh, back in. All right. Can you see your hand? Okay. So just want your arm completely loose, one relaxed. You look like you've done this before. No, I have not. <laughs> you have not? No. Oh, cool. So completely loose, one for relaxed, like a dish cloth, wet towel, dead weight? Yeah. Okay. So if it, like, for example, what I want. Mm -hmm. Um. So do that for me. Mm -hmm. Like fingers out. Maybe. Like, uh, okay, so like, for example, do you feel how, Yeah. without me supporting my, without you supporting my arm, my arm falls. That's how I want your arm to be. Okay. Does that make sense? So yeah. A lot of your fall, drop it. Okay. Just like that. Yeah. Great. Okay. Perfect. So that's all you need to do. Focus on my voice. Focus on my eyes. Look directly in my eyes. Take a de deep breath in. And sweet now, deep breath you can do all the way down. Perfectly in the trance, all the way down, staying in the trance. And we want to have you in this deep state of relaxation. I'm going to go ahead and move the camera closer to you. And I'm going to test your arm for cataplexy. Looks like a very successful trance induction, so great. All right, so if you've ever been hypnotized in the past, any post and suggestions you've ever been given are completely invalid, no longer working. And, um, no longer active, no longer working. Um, and <clears throat> the only suggestions you're going to respond to at the moment are going to be mine. Whenever I snap my fingers and say the word sleep, you're going to go back into the deep state of relaxation and trance that you're in right now. And I'm going to um, have you um, converse with me and talk to me while you're in this deep stage of, stage of trance. You're going to be able to respond, answer my questions. Without disrupting this trance, you're still going to respond to my suggestions um, while you're still in the trance and when you're emerging from the trance. So, um, I am going to have you forget the number three. It's going to be completely erased from your memory for the duration of this testing. When I tell you that the suggestion is removed, you're going to be able to remember it again. But not until I tell you to. So when you're counting my fingers, you're going to touch each of my finger points, fingertips, with your finger, and you're going to count them. One, two, four, five, and six. Number three is completely done from your, ma from your mind. Whenever I snap my fingers and say the word sleep, you're going to fall back into the trance. And I'm also going to be asking you, you're going to be able to rem um, remember any other hypnosis sessions you've ever been in, um, other than this one specifically, until I remove the, amnesia, the final amnesia for this session. So, um, again, you're not going to be able to remember, remember the number three, and whenever I snap my fingers and say the word sleep, you're going to return back into this amazing amazing, calm, relaxation, state of trance, without any difficulty at all whatsoever. So, when I snap my fingers right now, you're going to wake up. Okay. How many fingers am I holding up? One, two, four, five, six. Okay. All right, sleep. All right, so I'm going to have you emerge, emerge from this state of trance right now. I want to snap my fingers. You're going to um, remain in a trance, in a somnambulistic trance, deep state of relaxation. All you're going to be able to do is talk to me, converse with me. You're going to be able to understand what I'm saying, and you're going to be able to um, just have a conversation with me while you're in trance. So let's talk. All right. So, have you ever been hypnotized in the past by anybody else? No. Okay. That's good to know. Um, can you count my hand, fingers again? 
the projection should still be active. Why do I have six fingers? Count out loud. One, two, three, four. Do it again. One, two. So you seem very interested right now, please. All right. So um, we're going to have you forget that you even remembered the number three. I'm going to go ahead and wake you up again and do it again. Um, when I give you a suggestion while you're awake, um, I'm going to show you a video. of um, It's a shoe phone demonstration. I'm going to have you do it as well. Every time I say the word hypnosis, you're going to think that your shoe phone is ringing and that you need to answer your shoe phone call. You're going to pick up your shoe phone, take off your shoe from your foot, and you're going to start talking on the phone. Okay, so um, I'm going to have you wake up right now. Okay, how many fingers am I holding up? Can you count them? One, two, four, five, six. Okay, all right. So have you noticed um, any difference in hypnosis yet? Not really, no. No, so it's not making you feel anything? Okay, I'm going to show you a video. Okay. So, um, let's see here. So far you've been um, responding very successfully to automatic suggestions, which is great. I am going to show you this one, yes. Okay, watch this video for me. You talk to a celebrity on your shoe phone in a moment. Who do you want to talk to? Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds. All right, great. So um, I'm going to follow these suggestions and I found my finger sleep. Ooh. Ooh. Hypnosis. Ooh, that's so weird. Okay. So, um, yeah, count my hand, fingers again, rapidly. All right, so you're going to feel a vibrating sensation in your shoe, your right shoe, when you emerge from this trance, when you wake up and you open your eyes, um, and you're going to think that Ryan Reynolds is calling your shoe phone, you're not even going to notice any abnormality with your shoe phone ringing, you're going to think it's totally normal, um, you're going to think that it's, um, you know, like you just have a um, you know, shoe phone service provided by Verizon Wireless for free for you. Um, anyways, so you're going to have a conversation with Ryan Reynolds. You're going to talk about how he is um, a uh, um, 
um, football player. And uh, you're going to talk about how you think that he's into football, but he's an actor. And he's going to try to tell you that he's not into football. He's not a football player and that he's an actor. But you're going to tell him that you saw him in the NFL. In in Does that make sense to you? You can respond to me while you're in this trance. Nod your head. Okay, great. Um, I'm going to test your arm real quick for um, cataplexy. You're still limp and loose and relaxed, which is wonderful. Great. All right, so you're going to feel that vibrating sensation in your foot. Also, I'm not sure if you're in any pain right now. Um, for the duration of this example, um, if you're resisting taking off your shoe, you're going to feel pain in that foot until you take off the shoe. Then you're going to feel relief, and you're going to let me know how much you're enjoying the phone call, and you're not going to feel any pain at all. You're going to feel complete muscle relaxation as well as soon as you emerge from the trance. Um, and in the mornings when you wake up, it's going to feel like you're taking an Adderall um, every time you hear your alarm ring. Um, and uh, when you shut off an alarm, you're going to be alert, wake, focused, completely refreshed. It's very similar to when you're waking up from a hypnotic trance. No drowsiness. You're going to feel completely motivated. Um, all the good effects of Adderall, none of the side effects. None of the stuff that you uh, do not want. Only the things that you like. Um, that are help, helpful to you for work, for motivation, for whatever is in your best interest. So, again, um, <clears throat> you're not going to be able to feel any pain except in your um, foot. Um, it's going to be as if it's in your shoe until, until you take your shoe off. And um, afterwards, that pain is going to be completely gone. You're going to experience wonderful muscle relaxation. You're never going to have that, any of that tension again. Um, as long as it is um, in your best interest to do so, of course. Um, I just want to add in here that um, if your body, um, if you have any type of new injury or abnormal um, pain sensation, you'll be able to detect and recognize that as well. Um, and if you need the hypnosis to relieve that pain, um, you can have that, um, relieve that pain as long as you are aware of the extent of any type of injury that you have, just for your safety and your well-being. So I'm going to go ahead and merge you from the trance here in a moment. Um, just a reminder, you're going to do the exact same thing. Ryan Reynolds is going to be on the phone. You're going to think he's a football player. He's going to try to tell you that he's an actor, and you're going to be very confused by the entire situation. But you're going to feel um, great. Um, pain relief, and you're going to feel um, very happy and excited to talk to him anyways. So you'll um, just be able to talk to him without any difficulty. Um, it's not going to be an argument. He's just going to try to tell you, like, uh, he's going to ask you about the movies that he's been in, and you're going to tell him about the football games that you've seen him in. Okay, so go ahead and wake up. So anytime I say the word hypnosis, do you notice anything in your feet? Yeah. I mean, is it your right or your left? I think it was the right, right? It's this one. Okay, um, hypnosis is pretty interesting, isn't it? It's like a trigger word. Um, and um, have, have you, have, do you have any negative sensations or any um, weird feelings? Yeah, I do. What happens if you take off your shoe? Someone calling you? Okay, who's on there? Yeah? What's he saying? He's talking about movies. Yeah? Who's Ryan Reynolds again? He's in football. Yeah. I thought he did too. How, how Does your foot feel better? It does. Okay. So subconsciously, if you're able to remember everything I told you during that deep stage trance, and you're going to be able to follow through with that every morning, um, and it's going to be able to, those feelings are going to be able to last as long as you need them to. Even if Ryan Reynolds is making movies, they're going to be able, able to last as long as you need them to. So you're going to notice, as long as you're going to be able to comply with those suggestions, 
um, and you know that we discussed everything that you were wanted and that you're going to be able to follow through with that, that the phone's going to all of a sudden drop and you're going to realize what's, going to, what's happening right now. If you need me to remind you and put you back in your trance, then I'd start talking to Ryan Reynolds about football instead. Is it? What's Ryan Reynolds telling you? Okay, sweet. All right, so um, I'm going to go ahead and remove the um, our confusion suggestion. So what I want you to do, um, when you wake up from this trance this time, you're going to feel like you're on Adderall. Um, the suggestion that we were talking about where you're just feeling good, you're feeling energized and motivated, ready to work. All right, wake up. How do you feel? I feel good. Yeah? I feel good. Why do you feel that way? Like, how, how does it, can you describe the feeling? I want to get on new stuff. Yeah? Yeah. Does it remind you of taking anything? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Is it the right dose? Should be the perfect dose. Yeah. You have any pain right now? No. Any muscle tension? No. Why is your shoe off? I don't know. Okay. So, seems like we have a therapeutic level, don't we? Yeah. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and put you back to sleep. Okay, now what I want you to do, um, this time when you wake up, um, okay, so... Uh, this time when you wake up, um, you're going to pick up your phone again and you're going to start talking to me on it. Um, and you're going to tell me anything that you want me, want me to do with the hypnosis. Um, so um, basically you're using the phone as if, um, if I'm not hearing anything or if there's anything that you need me to know, you're going to use that shoe phone to tell me about it. I'm going to talk to you directly. You're going to be able to talk to me directly as well. If you feel it's easier to talk to me on the shoe phone, you can. Um, I, uh, every night when you go to sleep, I want you to be able to instantly fall asleep, just like when you instantly go into trance. Um, the suggestion to go into trance is only active when I say so, or whenever someone gives you direct consent and permission. I mean, whenever, I apologize about that. You're going to um, be able to understand what I'm saying. Um, the suggestion is uh, completely removing that previous part. We're going to go ahead and just say um, that the suggestion is actually only active whenever I put you in the trance so that we can go ahead and change and alter it as you need it, what's in be your best interest, and also whenever we need to um, have you uh, change the suggestions with anybody else that you would like. They're going to be able to put you into the same trance, um, but you have to give them verbal consent to be able to do so. You're going to be able to remember everything um, throughout this entire experience when you wake up. But you're still going to be talking on your shoe phone. It's just going to make sense to you because it does. So go ahead and wake up. How are you feeling now? Weird. You feel like you're on Adderall? Okay, I want you to. All right, so I want you to feel like you're on Adderall again when you wake up. I want you to feel really good, um, energized. I want you to feel like you're on the highest dose you've ever been on. Wake up. How do you feel now? Great. Phenomenal? And wonderful. What does it feel like? Feel. Does it feel like you took something? Yeah, it feels like how I felt in school, like more focused, like I can do something without like distractions, I can just do it. That's awesome. Is there anything you need to say on your show? I don't know. I mean, I'm, do you feel like I'm helping you? Yeah. 
Do you feel like you want to put your shoe on instead? Yeah? Can you? Like right now? Yeah. Hold on. Okay. Um, how many fingers am I holding up? One, two, four, five, six. Okay, great. That's the perfect amount. Please. Okay. So um, now when I wake you up, I want you to be uh, very coherent, um, alert, focused, um, very smart, um, you know, uninhibited by any means. So, um, you know, just like, uh, you know, coherent. And uh, I also want you to be able to still have that same suggestion. Um, that suggestion will only dissipate um, when you don't want it to be active. Um, for the demonstration, I want it to be active. Um, and um, every night you're going to be able to fall asleep um, within seconds, very easily, very quickly. Um, you're going to uh, naturally just tap, touch your nose and you're just going to fall asleep as fast as um, you fell asleep in tr trance here. Um, you're going to remember that you just need to touch your nose to fall asleep and you'll be able to do so. Um, you're also going to be able to touch your nose to go into hypnotic trance whenever you would like. Um, but you're going to know that you can only do that um, when I am around or when you are giving verbal consent for someone else to hypnotize you. Um, if um, you feel like um, anything is, I, if my instructions have been unclear, you're going to take off your shoe. Wake up. Mm. How do you feel? Good. Good? Good. Feel coherent? Yeah. Easy to do? Yeah. All right. Um, please. Okay. I want you to, um, this time I want, I want you to be able to remember the number three, but I don't want you to be able to pronounce the number three. You're only going to be able to um, pronounce the first syllable of it. You're going to um, just be able to pronounce the harder that you try, the more that you're going to screw it up. You're just going to, okay. So go ahead and wake up. How many fingers am I holding up? One, two. Try harder. Two. Perfect. Try harder. As hard as you can. You're doing great. Keep trying. What's the next number? Four. Next number? Five. Okay. What's the middle number? Six. Okay. Back to sleep? Okay. Um, also, I want to um, have you feel stoned when you wake up. Super stoned, but very clear and coherent as if you were on weed and Adderall at the same time. You're going to be able to, um, whenever you uh, tap your right earlobe, you're going to feel like you just smoked a fat blunt. You're going to be feeling super stoned, but super coherent at the same time. Um, I'm going to remove the previous suggestion. You're going to be able to count all the way up to five. You're going to be able to remember everything when you wake up. And again, whenever you tap your right ear, all you have to do is tap your right ear one time. You're going to feel super stoned whenever you want. Just like weed, you're not even going to be able to notice the difference. You're not even going to need weed anymore. You just have to tap your right ear. Um, whenever you want, uh, the left ear is going to be the on-off switch for the Adderall. You just have to tap it. And um, so the left ear is Adderall. The right ear is weed. Um, and I want you to go ahead and play around with this. When, I, um, when you emerge from the stress, wake up. Okay, how many fingers am I holding up? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, you remember everything. Yeah, that's weird. You remember everything, everything, right? That's weird. Okay, what, what do you feel when you tap your left ear? Now tap your right ear. But coherent, right? Yeah. That's weird. Do you like it? I like that. Yeah? I like that. 
So it's almost like they're on and off switches, huh? Yeah. And you know the difference between them, too, and you know what they do. Yeah. Do you like that? I do. I like that a lot. Yeah? And then what happens if you touch your nose? You're going to remember before you do it. And you're going to tell me before you do it. What does it do when you touch your nose? When you sleep. Okay, what happens if you do it? If I press my nose, it puts me to sleep, yeah. Do you want to? Not right now. Okay. Um, any... Uh, oh. oh, um, also... Okay, yeah. Um, okay, so like, um, you know, the suggestions will still be active tomorrow. When you wake up and you, um, you're going to change your alarm. So you're going to change your alarm to um, Adderall and Hypnosis. That's going to be the name of your alarm tomorrow. Okay. So you're going to remember your left ear, right ear. I'm going to send you these videos. Okay. I'm going to um, send you in a text message on the suggestions I gave you. Does that sound good to you? Yeah. All right. Do you need to check on your phone? Probably. Okay. So you remember everything that happened. We're all good? I do. Are you happy? I am. Um, so uh, you can watch the videos. Um, do you remember talking on your shoe and how weird that was? Yeah, that was really weird. So it was a good de demonstration. Um, but uh, so is there anything else that you want that I forgot? No, I think that's... Because uh, you remember the shoe thing is completely gone now. You don't need that uh, shoe suggestion at all anymore. You can just no. talk to me directly. Yeah. I'll be using my how, how do you feel muscle relaxation? Yeah. Can you become cataplectic? Cata uh, cataplexy? I left your arm. Mm -hmm. uh, that's catalepsy. Okay, so cataplexy is um, when it just drops. Okay, catalepsy. Catalepsy. Let it drop, right? Catalepsy is hanging. Okay. So just let it. Ha um, yeah, and that's supposed to happen automatically, and then catalepsy. Cataplexy. Okay, let's see if it happens involuntarily. Okay. Okay, so cataplexing your finger. Okay, finger's heavy now, dragging you down. Can't lift your arm now. Try to lift your arm. Mm -hmm. Okay, you have free uh, will now. Okay, so um, anyways, uh, so there's the pain, mm -hmm. right? If you need extra pain relief, um, I want you to, uh, um, what what would you want? You want that to be the chin? Yeah. Do you want to feel like you're on morphine? I don't know what that feels like. Have you ever taken a pain pill? More or less, yeah. All right. Um, do you like that feeling? Not always. Um, for some of them. Or would you rather just have like hypnotic pain relief? Like that, the stronger the Adderall feeling, the stronger the stone feeling, just stronger pain relief. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. All right. So do you want that to be the chin? Okay. Mm -hmm. Sleep? Okay, so that's going to be the chin. Um, the Adderall and stone feeling with more intensity, um, the more that you need the pain relief. Um, when you wake up, you're going to be able to feel pain again, just like normal pain, not any extra pain. Um, and you're going to have to tap your chin to turn on the pain relief. It's going to be like a morphine drip of Adderall and weed um, with only the positive side effects. So wake up. How does your arm feel? You don't like it? What happens if you touch your chin? You like that? That feels better. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, oh, I remember also. Okay, so um, uh, there is, um, so you have your motivation, right? Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, I mean, you feel like uh, you got everything that you need? Yeah. All right, awesome. Um, oh, uh, also endurance. So, like, um, when we were talking about, like, the sexual stuff, everything mm -hmm. along those lines, um, I mean, you could get, like, an erection on and off whenever you want. Um, yeah. You could, uh, you know, last as long as you need to. Um, everything along those lines. Um, uh, perfect dexterity, um, improved performance, 
Um, just like when you notice, like, say, for example, Adderall improves your handwriting, you just write neater and it just goes more smoothly. It's going to be the same thing with your sex life now. Does that sound good? All right, great. Okay, so I want you to um, go ahead and apply all those suggestions that I was just telling you in regards to your sex life. Improved performance, improved um, uh, orgasms, improved, uh, you're going to be able to last longer, more endurance. And um, everything is going to be smoother, just like when you're taking Adderall, your performance with your sex life is going to improve, just like with, um, as if uh, you took Adderall and it was helping to improve your handwriting, it was, it was neater, neater, more organized, more beautiful type of handwriting. That's going to be your sex life. Your sex life is going to be amazing. Um, also, you're going to have improved endurance with um, just everything that you need to do whenever you need it. If you ever need a boost, um, you can tap the top of your head um, and you can change and alter the suggestions that you like. Um, but you always, uh, and then if you need to do a factory default reset, back to the suggestions that I gave you, um, you're going to tap the back of your head. That is the only suggestion that you're not going to be able to change. Um, so the back of your head is going to be right here. You just have to touch that spot. Um, you know, anywhere in the generalized area could be a, a small tap as long as it's within, you know, the back of your head region. Um, and you can just factory default reset it. So I'm going to have you um, play around with changing the suggestions um, to whatever you would like when you wake up um, to see how that works out. So wake up. So it's kind of like a remote control. Um, if you tap like your left finger, right, um, what suggestion would you want? We have that list. Do you remember that? Like, um, I mean, I could uh, have that be, um, let's see, uh, do you want to try, um, okay, if you tap your index finger, you're going to uh, forget the number four. Um, if you close your fingers like this, you're going to forget the number four. You have the ability to change these as you want, right? Mm -hmm. So um, you're going to count my fingers, you're going to skip over the number four, and you're going to count um, five and six. Mm -hmm. So you're going to count one, two, three, five, six, okay? So um, that's only going to be active when you do that. When you release that, and you want to be able to remember the number four again, you just release it. You let go of it, mm -hmm. right? Okay. So um, do you want to try it? Okay. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and make the hand gesture first, because you have to. Just make the hand gesture. Okay. And how many fingers am I holding up? Can you count them? One, two, three, five, six. Okay. Why do I have six fingers? What happens if you release your hand? Why do I have six fingers? Can you count it? One, two, three, four, five. You understand why that happens though, right? That's weird. But you have the ability to change it. Yeah. However you want. So that one's going to be inactive now. Okay. That's weird. So um, if you ever um, have any doubt that you're not able to change a suggestion, you can text me mm -hmm. and ask, hey, can I change a suggestion? And if I give you permission, then it's done. Okay. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. All right. Um, check your phone. Yeah. Um, did I forget anything? Like um, all your suggestions are back to normal, right? Yeah. Um, I mean, you know, like you remember the factory default reset? Mm -hmm, which is back in the head. Yeah. Okay. So, like, let's say, for example, um, uh, you for, um, let's say, uh, all right, you forget where you are and you feel lost um, when I tap your hand, right? Um, and uh, I'm going to have you factory default reset to find your location, okay? Where are you? Okay, you're going to think you're in Egypt on a pyramid. It's like I'm wearing a pharaoh hat, huh? All the sand around is crazy, isn't it? I don't like sand. You want to go back? Mm -hmm. Do you know how to get back? Mm -hmm. The way back is by tapping the back of your head. Do you remember why? Reset. Yeah, can you do that? Where are you? In a hotel room. Okay. Was that scary for you? That was weird. 
I want you to only be able to change your suggestions in the positive experiences. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yeah. Can you remember to do that? I can't. You're not going to be able to scare yourself again like that, okay? Okay. So um, go ahead and check your phone now. Yeah. I wanted to make sure that you have remembered that. Um, what happens if you touch your right ear? That's stone, right? That's, yeah, that's a stone. This one's the outer roll. And then your chin is pain relief? Chin is pain relief. Any pain? A little. A little? What happens if you touch your chin? And you don't have to keep touching it. It's just, you know, it's like very long lasting. It's completely gone. That's way better. Yeah? Yeah. All right. So I'm going to send you these videos. The suggestions are going to get stronger and stronger. Okay. The more that you remember it and the more that you watch the video, right. the more time passes on, the stronger it gets. You don't have to practice anymore. You just do it. It's automatic. Okay. And it's at the intensity that, that you want in order for you to be able to function. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. And it is only when you want to change the suggestions that these things happen. Right, right. Or I want to activate the suggestions that these things happen. Nobody else can do it for you. Okay. Um, the only person that can put you to sleep is me. And anybody that you give verbal consent to hypnotize you. And um, I'm not going to hypnotize you without your permission either. Right. Um, and uh, I mean, honestly, do you feel comfortable with me being able to do that just for the sake of making it easier, less complicated? I don't know. Because I want you to feel comfortable. Okay. I want you to feel safe and to know that you're safe. Yeah, I feel pretty good. You remember everything too, right? Yeah. Um, Weird blows. Okay. So I want you to um, write down the number, um, how long the video is um, recording, mm -hmm. and then I want you to end the video after you write it down, and you're going to take the piece of paper with you. Okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Just so you remember, like, uh, you know, the video is not edited or altered. I can right. send it to you, and uh, you don't have to worry about anything like that. Right. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, I get that. Does that make you feel better? Yeah. Okay. Can you do that? Yeah. Uh, I can. I have notes. Okay. Um, I want you to have a physical piece of paper, too. Is that okay? Yeah. I'll probably just rely on the paper. Uh, put it in your phone, too. Okay. Um, you don't have to um, obey me like this, though. I mean, um, I am giving you, I've been giving you suggestions. I want um, you to only respond to my suggestions now when I have you in trance. You have your free will to to resist me. So now. just write the number. Does there. that make sense? Yeah. Okay. Just so um, like uh, you know, I mean uh, let's see. I want you to you know like spin in circles, right? But you don't have to, right? Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm okay. Good. Right. That's only when it. you're in trance, and yeah. you know like I'm not gonna um I um only when you really um give me permission I will make a change, right? Mm -hmm. I want you to do what you want. What is it? what is in your best interest. Yeah. Um, this is not for me. This is all for you, man. Okay. I do got to go, though. Okay. I don't mean to take your time. I apologize so much, but, um, uh, you know, like, uh, also, um, if you want, uh, you know, you can change your suggestions and alter them yourself. Mm -hmm. But um, if you want, you can go ahead and add in um, that you're going to sleep well tonight and you're going to feel super rested in the morning. Mm -hmm. Right? You're energized, you're ready to go, you're fully coherent, um, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, you only accept the suggestions when you um, want to, right? Yeah. Look at me, when you want to. <laughs> okay, cool. All right. So, um, you know, like, I, uh, that's another thing with hypnosis, is it can make you feel more rested from sleep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like you slept better. Yeah. So, um, go ahead and, like, if you feel like an ur need to feel urgency to leave, you can. Yeah. Um, I mean, uh, oh, I'm so sorry, it's the paper thing, isn't it? <laughs> That's what's making me feel like uh, it's a video thing. My bad. Yeah. yeah. Um, have paper, you know, hold that. And uh, pencils. Is it pencil? Okay. Write down the um, video recording time at the moment. And then um, you can put it on your phone. Just rip the piece of paper out. I know you're going to be in a hurry. Yeah.
Um, you need to text me an email address. You have, uh, you, you have a Google account? Yeah. Okay. Can you text me the e uh, Gmail address and then I will um, send you the video? I can. Awesome. Okay, here. Do it super fast if you can. All right, I sent the email. And um, I can also teach you hypnosis and how to help other people too. Yeah, that would totally be cool. Yeah? Yeah, awesome. Takes you some further steps. Yeah. Right. Um, so you texted me the email? Yeah. Awesome. So yeah, um, you need to stop the video though. Uh, you looking, okay, yeah, you can see your face too. Yeah. Um, you have to swipe the video screen. Like that way? Yeah. I'll keep the second video recording until um, you're like on your way home, man. Okay. And then you um, press the red button.